Hello everyone and welcome back to the channel. Today we are starting a new series. We are playing Sims 4. I love The Sims. I've been playing The Sims for a very long time. Um, I'm not great with all the controls and the building and everything, but it is something I enjoy and it's something I've done for a while. Um, so I'm really excited to get into it and share it with you guys. Um, for this series, we are actually going to be doing a challenge. I'm going to be doing the Rags to Riches challenge, um, and I will go over all of the rules and goals um, it needed to complete this challenge. Um, the first one being that I need to place my sim on the most expensive empty lot in the game, which is the Twin Oracle Point lot in Newcrest. Um, but if you can kind of tell, I'm not really in Newcrest. Um, I'm actually in Brindleton Bay. Newcrest is just really boring and, you know, I haven't built anything there. Like I said, I'm not really a huge builder. I'm still trying to get into that. Um, I'm first of all starting off with decorating and understanding, you know, the move objects cheat and everything like that. So it's still a work in progress. I'm still learning. Um, but I decided that it would be kind of fun to do it in Brindleton Bay because I've never had a sim live in Brindleton Bay. So I just thought that would be very exciting. Um, and then to set, you need to set your sims money to zero, which you can see I've already done. Um, but let's go ahead and get into the rules. So there's just a couple of rules um, that we need to follow. Um, five to be exact. So you must complete the corresponding mandatory steps first to achieve certain main goals of the challenge and you cannot skip them. You can only place items on your lot after completing the mandatory steps for building a home, which we'll get into. You cannot use any mods or cheats. The only exceptions are for getting your funds to zero, the move objects cheat, and resetting a sim. I have a couple of mods um, just for decorative purposes like extra you know furniture and clothes things like that so there's nothing that's going to affect the gameplay you may cook and eat at other slots but any food you make cannot be taken home so i can't you know go and to a grill at like the beach or the park and cook a five meals and bring all of them home i can just eat there and then leave any food that's left there um, you cannot place objects on public lots for survival, including beds, grills, and bathrooms. So that's like if I put like a bed at the gym so that I had somewhere to sleep. Other than these rules, you are allowed freedom about how to complete all the main goals of this challenge. So now let's get into the main goals and mandatory steps. So let's start with building a home. Um, build a home is the first main goal. It must have three bedrooms, two bathrooms, a kitchen and dining room, a family or living room, a study with at least one computer and an outdoor garden with a pool. Let's see, some of the mandatory steps is you must have a level five handiness skill and a level three in logic. You must pay a fine of $500 to the city for noise disturbances before you begin building. You must have your handiness skill at level 7 and your gardening skill at level 5 before you can begin building or placing items outside. And blueprints cost 500 simoleons. I don't understand that last one, but if you do, leave a comment down below. Have a family. Get married to a sim. If you create a sim, you must get rid of all their money, which I don't plan on doing. I'll probably just meet someone in the wild and then become a grandparent. So some of the mandatory steps for that, your sim must have a starter home to get married. You must max out all toddler skills before aging them up. To age a child to a teen, you must complete one of the following, level five in any skill and have perfect grades or level 10 in any one skill. To age a teen to a young, ag young adult, you must complete one of these, level five in any two skills and have a part-time job or level 10 in any two skills. You must pay for a, you must pay for and host a wedding every time a pair of sims gets married. The next goal is have a career. Choose any career. You may also run a restaurant or a store, which I don't plan on doing. Earn the entrepreneurial lifetime reward. Reach level 10 of the career branch. And some of the mandatory steps are complete mandatory steps for building a home. So that's clearly the first one we have to do to do any of these other goals and then pay 1,000 simoleons for a college degree. So it looks like we might be going to college. 
um, have money, I have a home worth at least 100,000 simoleons and have at least 200,000 simoleons in the bank. And there's no mandatory steps for that one. So it looks like we're just gonna have to start off with the building a home, three bed, two bath, kitchen, dining room, living room, study, and we have to have a garden with a pool. So the first thing we need to do is get some money and pay this $500 fine so that we can start building our house. So the first thing I'm gonna do is go over some of her traits and her career preferences and everything like that. Um, this is me. This is our little Sim. Um, her traits are outgoing, ambitious, kleptomaniac, and business savvy. I put kleptomaniac because it gives us the ability to steal things. And with that ability, we can steal things and sell them for more money. So that was my thinking with that. And we can also, you know, get different furniture and stuff to help furnish our home. Um, and then the outgoing will help her, you know, make better connections with people, ask them for small loans, anything like that. Um, the ambitious and business savvy traits are to help, you know, with her career, which will also in turn get us more money. So I'm all about the hustle. So her life aspiration is to be fabulously wealthy. I don't know why it says have 35000 in reserve as checked, maybe because it was before I made her... Uh, balance zero but we'll just pretend that isn't there and we will get that eventually um, we will have earned seventy five thousand dollars so that is looks like our next goal here but yeah I think that's everything here is our empty lot um, we have a pier right here so maybe we can go fishing um, or something like that a little picnic table so cute so I'm very excited to start this series um, but we should just go ahead and get into it. I think I've gone over everything that I need to to start with. So the first thing I think we should do is get a job. So I'm going to pull out my phone here and we are going to find a job. Select a career. So this is exciting because um, from her aspirations, you don't really see anything specific. So we can really go in any direction with this. Um, some of her likes and dislikes are um, like art and music. So if we want to do something that route, she might actually enjoy that and do pretty well. Um, or, you know, we could do something like one of these three and then there's a lot more for us to do. We can go to work with them because this is from the Get to Work expansion pack. Painter? I don't know why I'm really loving this idea of being a painter. So I think maybe we just go ahead and go with this. Cool, so we went ahead and got a job. So we don't have work until tomorrow, so I think maybe we do in the meantime some odd jobs. That way we can get a little bit of money before we start getting too hungry. So perfect, we have $400. Cool, I think we got some money here. I don't know what that was from, but... That's cool, at least we have $400 in the bank. Um, let's go ahead and look at what some of the odd jobs are that we can do. So at the moment, we don't have any any skills. Um, so I guess we should just do whatever has the lowest, which looks like the sand sculptor judge. Um, Charisma level one, I think let's go ahead and go with that. So off she goes. Let's see how much we get from this. Okay, let's see here. Sammy viewed fancy sandcastles, checked some boxes, drank some free punch, and it was a good day at the beach, and she got paid. What beats that? Awesome, so we just got $105, so we have a whopping $505. Let's see if there's anything that we are able to even do with that, if we can even get a roof over our heads or a bed to sleep in. I think this might be a good option. What color should we do? That might be the best. <laughs> okay. There we go. There's our bed. <laughs> um, we just have no money, so we kind of need to stay on top of doing these odd jobs. Maybe it'll be a little later in the day and we can go find something to do while we wait it out. I'm hosting this huge annual beach bash, and I'm pretty sure more people are going to show up than last year's. Totally going to need someone to bring some extra Kahlua pork or anything else or else there's no way I'm going to be able to make enough food for everyone. But I think that might be the best option. It's the lowest skill, so let's just try that and see what happens. Okay, let's see. Task. Oh, cook Kahlua pork and mail it. Find or place a barbecue pit. Choose any interaction. Okay, so we're going to go on a little adventure. We're going to travel.
cook Kahlua pork. Let's do that. We got two minutes. Oh! Oh! Serve meal! Look at that! Grab a serving. Wait, okay. How do I mail this? Okay, did we put that in our inventory here? Yes, we did. Awesome. Oh, we should have peed, actually. Wait, don't go home yet. We're gonna use the bathroom first. Okay, so now we're gonna click on the mailbox. Mail Kahlua pork. I'm pretty sure, I don't think we can do odd jobs um, anymore because it's too late. Oh, maybe we can. Let's try. I was gonna say, I think it might be too late. I think they're done by like seven. Um, maybe we just go with this wingman one, um, and maybe we'll start a charisma love or a charisma skill. Probably not though, since we're not the ones doing it, but we'll, we'll see how it goes. So let's try that. When is that going to be? 7 p.m. Oh, so right now. Perfect. Off she goes. And she's back. Okay, so we got $25. Oh, Sammy wasn't particularly good at the wing woman thing. Most of the sims the client was interested in attracting were instead attracted to Sammy, which kind of defeats the purpose of her being there. Unsurprisingly, the review the client left wasn't very positive. Well, that sucks. <laughs> um, so I guess we didn't last very long. Well, the time says we lasted three hours, but we did not get all that money. <gasps> Who is this? Oh my gosh, a little kitty. Should we say hi? Friendly introduction to Murphy. Oh, <gasps> talk to. Let's say hi. He's so cute. We're just going to keep getting to know this little guy. This is going to be our little best friend. We'll adopt him one day. Hopefully. Oh, so cute. Work in 10 hours. Yes, so we have work in the morning. I think we should get a good night's rest. Then we can be ready to go if we have anything that we need to get together before we start work. Our first day of work. Oh, girl, wake up. You're going to go straight to work? Okay, she's going straight to work, I guess. Oh, she also has to pee. Oh my goodness, this is too much right now. Okay, hold on. Oh god, okay. I don't know, now I'm a little stressed because she has to go to work. She's probably not going to make it. Oh, have a quick meal. Okay, let's have a ham and cheese. Come on, are you going to make it? Are you going to make it? Maybe? Is she going to take it to go? Go home. Go to work. Go what? Oh, I don't know about this. Go to work. Go to work. I don't know if we can do this. She got a couple bites in. That That's something, right? She is a little late, though, for her first day. She is gonna need a shower, so we'll probably have to hit the gym when she gets back. Wow, $2,000! Oh my gosh! Scoring Simoleon's Discovery Quest. Wow, so the Discovery Quest gave us 2,000 Simoleons. That's crazy. Um, well, that's good. Now we'll have a roof over our head tonight, um, but let's actually go ahead and go to the gym so we can take a little shower and then we maybe we can start adding things to our house. We must have a level 5 handiness skill and level 3 in logic, so we need to work on that and I think the best way to get the handiness skill up is the workbench. Um, then you can just like build things and help build the skill. And then level three in logic. Um, I think you can do that by playing chess, um, which they have like at parks. Um, and then we need to pay a fine of $500 to the city for noise disturbances before we start building. So before we put anything down, we need to pay that fine. And there's not like an in-game way to do that. So the only way we would do that is by using the cheats. Um, so we're going to make her amount two zero nine one so that'll put us five hundred dollars less okay so we've gone ahead and we've paid that fine um and now we need to work on our handiness skill and our logic skill it doesn't say that we have to do that before we start building though so we i think we can go ahead and put a roof over our heads 
Okay, so let's go ahead and enter build mode. Um, um, did she steal this? No way. No way she stole this, stole this at the gym. <gasps> she swiped it at work. Oh my gosh. <laughs> That's awesome. Okay, well, we're definitely selling that. 40 extra dollars right there. Um, okay, let's go ahead and put... A little roof over our heads. Yeah, I don't know, but I think I'm gonna put the initial house like right, right about here. Ooh, that's a lot of money right there. Maybe I should start a little smaller. We'll, we'll do that. We'll do that. Um, and then she needs a door. Is this the cheapest one? I think so. Yep. There, we've got a door. Um, we need a roof. Perfect. A little, well, okay, we can put a little window, like that. Perfect. Wonderful. Okay, awesome. We do need a toilet. I think that that is a necessity here. Hold on. Is this a bush you can pee in? Okay, well, yeah. Yeah, let's do that. It's literally cheaper than the toilet. Yeah, and then it's outside, so... It's not like, you know, gross, because it's inside with the rest of us. <laughs> it's not gross at all, guys. Um, let's see. Can we put like a microwave or something? Would it even work in here? Let's do that. How much is a fridge? I'm scared to look. Uh, I don't know if we do it. I don't know about that. I think we definitely need a sink. Oh, I don't know. Hold on. We're gonna need a, a counter here. Yep, that that's gonna do. And then we'll put the sink right there. We probably need a trash can though. Okay, let's just do that one. Why can't the, oh, it's a doorway. Duh. Let's put it over here. There's a little home! Perfect, that's every, our bank account is like empty now, but at least we have somewhere to pee, we have somewhere to sleep, and we have somewhere to make some freaking food, dude. Um, I'm thinking we could squeeze in possibly another odd job here. I think the paid cleaning volunteer work would might be the best option here. Comb the beach for trash, so let's go ahead and go to the beach. And how many times do we need to do this? Three times, that's it? Okay. Beach comb for trash. Beach comb for trash. Beach comb for trash. Let's do it. I think we can also, um, start, like, dig for seashells. And we can sell the seashells. So maybe let's do a little bit of that. I wonder, we should go fishing. <gasps> Uh-oh. She touched something. And then we can get that fishing skill, which um, there's that other odd job for. Oh, you're fine. It's fine. What? No, don't start making some shit. Don't make- don't use money right now. Don't do it, girl. Sit. Oh, steal it. Steal it. Steal it. Steal it right now. That's cute. Steal it right now. Yeah, she did it. She did it. Why does it say she can't fish? I'm so confused. Am I tripping? Like, what? Go fish. Bro, what is she talking about? Look at what's over here. Let's do this. That'll help her for work, I bet, too. Create paintings, not started. <laughs> oh my gosh, I'd love to know that there's one, like, in the game. Oh, I love it. So cute. Let's frame it. Let's sell it to a collector. Granted, we made no money. We're in the negative with that one because it was $100 for the frame and they only gave us 98 So let's do another. What's a figure painting? Let's find out. Oh, but she's hungry. Yeah, we'll go home after this. Mm -hmm. 
Level two already. Look at that. Sell that to collector, baby. You made money. You made some money tonight. That's right. That's right. Let's go home. Okay, we're back. Let's see how much that decoration we stole was. $125 Cobble Bowl. Crazy. Love that. I was not expecting $125 for that. But that's cool. Okay, so let's go ahead and cook. Girl, I don't want to cook. We can't just have a quick meal. Oh, I think that's with the fridge only. Dang it. Cook. Oh, we need a fridge. We do need a fridge. That is sucks. I guess we gotta spend some money on a fridge. Maybe I'll put the sink over here and the fridge over here. Okay, that's pretty good, I think. Oh, there's no light in here. It's dark as fuck. Okay. Let's put one single light up here. Oh, well, maybe we'll put two. Perfect. Now we got lights. Let's have a quick meal. Have a little ham and cheese sandwich. I feel like that's like one of the heartier options. So we'll eat that and then we will go to sleep. And then we do have work again in the morning. Um, it is a little late, but I think we'll be okay. Just sitting on her bed and entertaining herself. You hear her? She's just laughing. Oh, what? Did we not? I thought we... I guess I never checked to see if she actually completed it. Whoops. Oh, well. That sucks. I don't know what her odd jobs rating is now. Hey. Off she goes. Looking like Bob Ross. Oh, she's been promoted. Okay, let's see. Sammy's been promoted to Arcbook Collator. She will now make an additional $2. Oh, awesome. Um, for a grand total of $25 an hour. She also received the following bonus, $422. Awesome. So we just got pretty much our fridge back. Um, the picture perfect art lighting research art reference on the computer. Her next shift is Wednesday. So tomorrow, um, 9 a.m. to 5 p.m. I think that is the same hours. So perfect. That's cool. Making a little more money. Um, but tonight is all, all about celebrating. Um, she's gonna make this food and then we are actually, she's not. We're just gonna go straight out, out on the town. Um, it said that it gave us some lighting or something. I think we can sell that. Yep, a hundred dollars and a dirty dish. Okay, perfect. Um, so we're not gonna do that and instead... We're gonna travel. We're gonna take Layla with us. Layla seems to be, you know, just a one, a little girly, a girl, a friend. Okay, should we go to this lounge, or should we go to this bar? Um, I'm thinking maybe we go to the lounge. It looks like there's a pool or something, so there might be more things for us to do. Discuss interests. We don't really know much about her. So it's good to know. Gaffa. Yibs. Oh, Pandola. Bon and Gravy. <laughs> huh. Oh, this is like like country club vibes, not like like a like a lounge that I was thinking of. Okay, that's still cool. Who's what? this? Oh, Marcus God. Flex. Let's go say hi to him. Joining in on this conversation. Uh, uh, ask about career. <laughs> ask Victor about his career. Whoa, there's someone. There's paparazzi taking pictures of Judith in the bathroom. Is she okay? No? Okay. Anyway, maybe let's go have a seat at the bar. Sit and chat here. Gym trainer. Marcus is a gym trainer. Cool. What about Victor? Julia. Let's, should we order a drink? I don't know, guys. We're kind of broke. Friendly introduction. Not the gym, bro. Oh, oh my gosh. That gave me the ick. Um, let's say hi to this. Oh, this is Layla. <laughs> Who's that? Mortimer Goth. Let's say hi to him. 
Quick introduction. Ah. So we're just trying to build some relationships with people, um, get out there, make a bunch of friends. Oh, oh, looks like the party's over here. Who are all these friends? Let's go here. Okay, and while we're here, we, we could start our little singing skill. Oh, we could practice acting. Let's practice singing. Wow. That's beautiful, guys. Do you hear that? She just gave me a tip. I must be great. She <laughs> gave me one, too. I wish there was something for us to steal, but there isn't. And then we'll eat, and then we'll go to sleep. Okay, get up. Go to work. Come on. Girl, why are you just sitting there? Yeah, get your ass up. Look at look at that attire. She's back. We made two hundred dollars today. Um, she's a little stanky, so let's wash hands. Let's brush our teeth. Scent sink type. Oh, I didn't know I could do that. We'll brush our teeth again, and this helps with that hygiene. I think the next thing we should buy is the workbench so that we're able to start working on our handiness skill. Woodworking table. That's what we need. How much is this? <gasps> Ooh. Ooh, that's that's not good. Yeah, that sucks, but we, we're gonna need it, guys. We, we do. And we should get chests just so that we can build that skill, too. Oh, we can't afford it. Damn, that sucks. We'll have to go do that publicly, I guess. Um, let's let's craft some stuff though, because then we can start working on this handiness skill. Because I think in total we need we need to be at least at level seven. I'm pretty sure for like the whole challenge. To start out, we just need it for five to be at five. Oh, she's out in the rain. She's not comfy. Let's go to sleep. Yeah, good. Go what? Send home. What the hell are you doing here? Go to sleep. Okay, I think when she wakes up, she needs to have a serving of that. Oh, boy! Yeah, you're, you're a little stinky. Let's sell these sculptures she made. What? what? Where did you get this? Stolen. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Okay, okay, girl. And then she's going to go to the gym and take a shower. Yes, girl, get get in that shower. Take a nice steamy shower. Awesome. So now she's going home. So until we start getting enough money and really working on our funds and you know, can get the home situation sorted out. Then we can start moving into some other stuff, um, you know, that's a little more exciting. Like, once we have a home together, decorating the home will be so fun. Um, we don't really have to rush to get all of these main things done, you know. I want to have fun with it and, you know, start off with, like, a little small house and then we can grow and... Just enjoy it, you know. I'm not in any rush to finish this series or to get uh, to finish the challenge. Um, I still want this to be enjoyable Hi, and, yeah. you know, just relax. Um, I'm excited for us to build a house from the ground up. I've never, I've done that maybe like once and it was, it was not good. Um, now that I've started getting the hang of decorating a little bit more and using, you know, the move objects chi and freely moving objects and learning how to layer them and everything like that. Um, it's a lot nicer and a lot more fun to decorate. Some things can be a little frustrating for sure, um, but I, I'm just excited that we get to do it from the beginning and you know, we only have $400 in our account right now, but that, that will change. Whoa! Look at all these little birdies! Aww. Anyway, um, I think I'm going to go ahead and end the episode here. She's working on a little more woodworking to enhance that skill. She's already reached handiness level two. Um, <clears throat> but I think that was a successful first episode. You got to see her a little bit. Um, we built our little, our little she shack here that is going to get us by. 
Um, and I'm excited to see what comes of this series. Um, if you guys have anything specific you want to see from me in this series, leave a comment down below and I would love to try it out. But other than that, I hope you guys have a wonderful rest of your day and I will see you next time. Bye!